Matt Foes, the Regional Agronomy Manager with 360 Yield Center here today, reporting from the sprayer cab. So just wanted to pass along some of the things as, as people start to side dress or uh, get ready to side dress this corn crop, what we're seeing from a soil profile, where the nitrogen is at right now in the profile. So a lot of the uh, nitrogen that was applied last fall in the form of ammonia, uh, as, as we've said before, has converted very quickly over the winter and subsequently this spring uh, and is all in nitrate form for the most part. Uh, and early season applications of either UAN or ammonia converted during a period of warm weather. Uh, what we've seen today so far is that a lot of that nitrogen is still in the profile, so we haven't flushed it, we haven't lost it, at least not in the Illinois area. It's still there, it's between, uh, part of it lies in the top foot of soil, and part of it lies slightly below in the second foot of soil. Now, how do I measure those, or how do I, how do I quantify how much of that's gonna be useful uh, as, I, as I go into the season? So if I think about the second foot of soil, I put about a 50% usable value on it. So if I've got 40 pounds in the first foot, another 40 pounds in the second foot of soil, I'm going to consider that first 40 very usable. The second 40, probably, I'm going to think about that as 20 pounds instead, because I don't have the root mass that extends down into the second foot of soil quite as much to extract that nitrogen. So with that said, as you look at your nitrate levels, test this year, because you may be slightly lower than you expect in the usable portion of the soil. We want to make sure that as we make this trip across the field, we're getting the correct amount on. So utilizing a soil scan or utilizing uh, a lab test, however you like to do it, go ahead and test this year so that we end up putting the correct amount on. We've got one heck of a corn crop growing, in, at least in this area, and a lot of potential markets are responding to some extent and for that reason I don't want to come up short. I planned this year to be very thin or as thin as possible on expenses but at the end of the day the way the conditions are I want to make sure I maximize what I what I have to you work with. So with that I'll let you get down the road and uh, be safe out there and as always uh, come back for more hopefully helpful hints from 360 Yield Center. Thank you.